Hey everybody, it's your girl Karen Craig, better known as the Jewelry Box Queen, and I am an independent consultant for Paparazzi Accessories, and you are watching Jewelry Box TV. Well, today I am going to show you nothing but earrings today. Earrings, earrings, earrings everywhere. I'll have um, all different styles, all different colors. I'll even have some clip-on earrings for the ladies whose ears are not pierced. So you will see all kinds of earrings. And as always, you can check out the turntable, Hubby's Choice Turntable. And that's where he's picked out four pair of earrings just for this show. So those were some of his favorites that he liked. And all of the earrings are for pierced ears, and they are only $5. So we have um, a pair of little red earrings with uh, the hang, have a little red uh, bead in there, and we have some acrylic plastic earrings, and then we have gold hoops, large gold hoops, and then we have a nice pair of blingy rhinestone hoops. So all of those are $5 lead and nickel free, and those are all for pierced ears. And also is, I have my model today, and here she is, Miss Sierra, Miss Drama Queen, Cece. This is number 87. As you can see, she is blinging it out today with these nice rhinestone and gold hoop earrings. So this is a big circle hoop. And as you can see, she's all masked up. And then she was trying to ask me, you know, Karen, where's your mask at? I told her to mind her business. I'm working. I, I can't wear a mask while I'm working right now. You're not going to be speaking, so keep your mask on and you can social distance yourself from me. So, you know, she's always drama. I can only let her come out every now and then. She's just too much. But if you like what Sierra is wearing, comment 87. And those earrings can be yours. Those are really cute. And they look cute on her, too. But don't let her know that. So that is the first set of earrings. And then we're just going to get started. And I'm going to adjust my crown. I'm going to put my little eyes on so I can see what I'm doing. And then we are going to start with our very first pair of earrings. So my first pair, this is number 12. And as you can see, it's a turquoise blue earring. And it's some silver. And then it looks like it has little leaves hanging from the bottom that gives you that nice fringe look. And it has a silver filigree back right here. And these are for pierced ears. I will get to clip-on earrings a little bit later in the show. So if you are someone that wears clip-on, stay tuned. But these are real pretty. If you like that southwestern look, in that turquoise color, comment Soul 12, and these can be yours. All right, now my next pair, this is number 20. These are really pretty because this is like a ice blue. Okay, ice blue hanging down from the fringe right there. So it's a pretty sky ice blue. So if you like that fringe look, and I'm trying to uh, group the different styles together this time. So if you kind of like the fringe look, dangling earrings, um, I'll have a few pair for you to look at and they are all in different colors. This is the ice color blue, so comment 20, sold. Next pair is purple. Look how pretty that is. This is number 82. So you have a purple bead at the top, and then you have several purple beads below. It has that silver filigree look. Those are really nice. And these are a little larger earrings, as you can see, compared to my little number, how large they are. But if you like those, and you like the color purple, comment sold number 82.
Okay, my next pair. Look at these. This is number 84. And this is a different style hoop. Once again, it has a silver filigree and then it has like, uh, look like little teardrops hanging down at the bottom to give you that fringe look. So if you kind of like that southwestern style, maybe Native American looking, you can get these. These are a silver comment sold number 84. This is number 81. These are in brown. So you have the brown beads. I'm going to lift that up just a little bit. You have the brown beads. And then behind the beads, you have these little brown discs that are engraved. So they almost look like coins behind it. Okay, so if you like dangling earrings that have that trench look, you need color brown, get this pair. Only $5. Number 81. Right, and look at my next pair. This is in like a beige cream color. Okay, so if the brown was a little too dark, you wanted something a little lighter, and you can get this. So it has the beige stone right in the middle, and then the smaller um, brown, like cream color, beige, and they have the veining going through them. So these are really cute too. So if you like that style, number 83, comment salt. Okay, now my next pair, these are definitely unique looking earrings. They're in red, and they kind of have that ethnic look to them. This is number 80. So, they have like half circles on there. It looks like it has engraving, but it has the red beads. And so they dangle too, ladies, so they move when you move. So these will make a nice pair if you like the color red, and you like that fringe look. Get these pair for only five bucks. Plus tax. Okay, now I have another pair of pink. Okay, so it's up against the black. It's a little hard to see. You'll be able to see the picture when we show the picture. But this is number 85, and they are like a pink, very light red color. So they have a little fringe on the bottom. These are real pretty too. So if you like that look, you want that color pinkish red, reddish pink, <laughs> you can get these. The Common Soul 85, only $5, you guys. See how nice that looks? So number 85. Now I have this in red. Look how pretty those are. This is number 72. Okay, so you have a little red bead at the top and multiple beads at the bottom to give you that fringe look. You have that filigree look that gives it that bling to it. And these are on fish hook setting. So if you like red, why don't you pick these up for yourself or maybe a nice gift for someone that um, you have a birthday coming up and they like the color red. Give them something different. Help them change up their style a little bit. Comment sold number 72. is in black. Look at those. Those are really pretty too. This is number 86. So you have black beads and then you have a top. So you got a small one and a larger one. Then you have the black beads down below. See how they move? 
at that fringe look. We go out dancing whenever we can get back to dancing. Or you can dance in your house, put your earrings on, <laughs> shake them up. But this is number 86. And don't forget that turntable, you guys. You can order anything off of there for just five dollars. So comments sold in the corresponding number, and they can be yours too for five bucks. Okay, look at this pair. This is number eighty-eight, and this is a purple. Might be a little hard to see against the black, but as I said, once we see the picture, you'll be able to see the vibrant purple color. But it has the purple stone up top. It has some little. Um, purple beads down below so it is purple beads down below um, but these are real pretty too for that fringe look so this is number 88 comment sold so you can see how nice purple that is so if you like purple that might be the color for you This next pair is in pink. Look how pretty those are. So it's like the pink, like rhinestones, along with that filigree back crown to them. And it has the teardrop shape at the bottom in pink. So it's almost like a looks like a black and I mean like almost like a purple silver color gunmetal. So this is number 89. So you can see these are a little longer. So they'll hang a little lower on your ears, and they're not heavy at all. Um, none of these earrings are, earrings are heavy, so you don't have to worry about, oh, my ear might split. No, you'll be okay. So this is number 89, Comet Sword, 89. something for the ladies that like gold so this is a different look so it has like a teardrop shape almost this is number 71 but it has little gold beads at the bottom to give you that fringe look okay so they do move when you move so if you like gold and you want something a little bit smaller fringe but a larger earring you can get this this is number 71 Comment sold. Okay, look at my next pair. This is a simple studded rhinestone earring. This is number 77, and the background of it's in gold. So if you like that stud look, of diamonds get this this is only five dollars and maybe you have the man in your life or a young man that wants to have a diamond stud and you can't afford it well you get two you can give him one you can give his dad one and or if they wear both of them in their ear hey five dollars get the diamond stud 77 comment sold number 77 show you a pair of big rhinestone that look like diamond earrings okay and they dangle so it's like a um, princess cut number 76 so if you like that large rhinestone diamond look you'll definitely like these this would make a really nice uh, accessory to go with um, that nice cocktail dress or a gown if you have a special event or you just could wear them with a pair of jeans too if you want but they're only five dollars. Comment sold number seventy six. Lead nickel free. Okay, 
Okay, now I have a different pair of rhinestones. Okay. They have more of a teardrop shape and with some smaller rhinestones accenting the big stone. So this is number 75. So, you know, you can still get that diamond look, but just a different shape. Instead of the princess cut, you can get the teardrop look. So this is number 75, common sole, and it can be yours. nice pair and it looks like it's black but it's actually a very very dark green gemstone number 74 and these are post earrings they look like they might be clip ones but they're not they're post so they're not the official um, but they have green rhinestones and little white rhinestones to accent so this will fit close to your ear so if you like that dark dark green gemstone you'll like this pair Number 74, Common Soul. Okay, now my next pair of earrings. This is number 73. Wait for my camera shot to come up. There we go. This is number 73. So now we have a black stone with the teardrop shape. And it has uh, like a filigree look cut to it. And these are in black. So if you like black earrings, and these could be dressy or casual. They're only five dollars. Common salt number seventy three. Okay, now I have a pair that looks very similar to what we just looked at, but it's in brown. This is number 57. So it's the same little, has a brown stone, and then it has that filigree cut to it. So if you like brown, and you're looking for a nice casual. And these can also be dressy too. So it just depends on what you accessorize um, your outfit with. You can make it dressy or you can make it casual. But this is number 57. Comic Soul. Okay, now I have another pair of silver and turquoise earrings. Okay, this is number 70. And then this has a different shape than the first pair that we have. So you have the turquoise stone in the middle. And it has like the little, uh, I don't know, I guess that's kind of almost like a teardrop, almost a teardrop shape. Almost. But if you like that southwestern look, you'll like these. This is number 70. Common Soul, number 70. Earrings. 
I may be going out of order for my husband. He's probably looking for my pictures, but we'll figure it out. But this is a nice pair of gold circles. So you got two circles and then it's a post earring and it's in gold. Okay, and you'll be able to see it better on the picture. But this is number 78 and you can see how bright gold those are. That's number 78, Comet Soul. Okay, now I have a nice pair of pink earrings and this is number 79 and these are teardrop pink rhinestones Let me see that. and you'll see the picture a little bit better okay. but those are real pretty and they have like little uh, small rhinestones to go around its shape but the gemstone is right in the center so these are real pretty comet soul number 79 Now my next pair are black. This is number 56 and they almost look like a cluster of grapes because <laughs> it has uh, black and bright, white rhinestones all throughout and they kind of remind me of a cluster of grapes on your ears but they're in black. These are real pretty. They can definitely be dressed in and set off that nice little black dress that you wear. So comments sold number 56. Look at these, number 58. These are in black and white rhinestones. Electric shimmers, what this is called. And these are very long dangling earrings. Kind of have that geometric type look to it. And have the fish hook fitting. Okay, so these are real pretty. Definitely dressy, definitely. Common sold number 58. And don't forget about the turntable, ladies. Definitely you can pick those up. Now I'm going to get to my clip-on. So for all the ladies who um, don't have pierced ears and you know, maybe they can't wear pierced ears, earrings anymore, um, here's the section for you. This is number 59, and these are white rhinestone clip-on earrings. So they are the standard clip-on back. These are definitely really, really dressy. I like how it has the big rhinestone in the middle, and then it has rhinestones that come down. Okay, so this is number 59. Comet Soul, number 59. Now I have number 61, and these are also white rhinestones and silver with a teardrop shape, clip-on earrings. Okay, so definitely give you that nice dressy look that you can wear. Comet sold number 61. you're like, Karen, I want to see some color clip-ons. Well, I got a pair for you. These are purple clip-on earrings. So you have the purple gemstone. This is number 62. And it's surrounded by very small white rhinestones that accent it. So this is a nice purple gemstone. And like I said, you'll be able to see the picture on 
see that color, a little bit more vibrant purple for you. So that's number 62. If you like those pair of clip-on earrings, you can pick those up for just $5. Lead and nickel free jewelry, y'all. Okay, now look at these. These are number 63. And these are gold clip-ons. See how pretty those are? So if you like gold earrings, and you need clip-ons, why don't you pick this pair up for yourself? This will definitely be a nice addition to your jewelry box. So this is number 63, Comet Soul. Now I do have another pair of gold earrings for clip-ons. This is number 98. And as you can see, how pretty those are. Okay, so that's another pair of gold clip-ons. And this is number 98. All you have to do is comment sold number 98, and they can be yours for $5 plus tax. Let's see, let's see. Now my next pair of clip-ons, this is number 64, so these are silver, but it kind of has like little black threading going through them. It's almost like a little knot that they're in. So these will fit real close to your ear. There's no dangling with these, but they're real nice, kind of conservative. Thomas sold number 64. saying Karen you know I like the silver but I would like a little pop of color well I have these this is number 65 and they are silver but they have just a little hint of red throughout so they are red and silver earrings and these are clip-ons and they kind of have that teardrop shape okay so comment sold number 65 if you like red and silver together Okay, next up, how about just a pair of out and bright red clip-on earrings? <laughs> this is number 66. These are pretty too. So if you like red, that would definitely set off any outfit. This is number 66. Let's see how pretty that is. Nice big red bead right in the center. So these are just $5. Common sold, 66. So that was the last pair of my clip-ons that I have, but you can always go to my website, um, jewelryboxqueen.com, and you can see all of the clip-ons that they have. Just click on the earring tab, then the clip-on tab, and then you'll see all of the clip-on earrings that they are offering, and they change often. Okay, now I have a different style, and these aren't clip-ons. These are definitely for piercers. And these are black. So, a big circle. This is number 67. And they're post fitting. Okay. So, they do dangle a little bit, but a different way to have a hoop earring. Okay, you can see that a little bit better. So, this is number 67. And they kind of have like a hammered look to them. But this is a black, like a charcoal black. So, if you like big earrings like me, you might want to pick these up for yourself for just $5. So comment sold number 67. And no, they are not heavy. <laughs> Even though that sound like it was kind of heavy. And I dropped them on the table, but they're not heavy at all. So maybe you say, Karen, you know what? I like those, but they were a little too big for me. Well, I have a smaller black hammered look earrings. So a little circle earrings. So this is number 68. So if you don't want the real big ones, you can get the smaller ones. Okay, for just five dollars. So it has that hammered look, kind of like the color charcoal black. 
Number 68, Common Soul. That carry here, but I haven't seen any brass earrings. Well, I got a nice pair of so you kind of have half circles, and then it's like you have the smaller half up top. And these are in brass. This is number 69, and they dangle and they have the standard facial fitting. Okay, so if you like brass, you don't necessarily like the gold because it's a little too bright. You can get a pair of brass earrings for just five dollars. So, common sold number sixty-nine. We have another pair of brass earrings that is just a little bit smaller. This is number ninety-four. Okay. And they have like etching on them, it gives it that black look even though it's on brass. So it kind of like etched with black. With a fish hook fitting, the pierced ears, brass, comet salt number 94. Now this is a different look. This is number 95. These are acrylic or kind of like plastic. So you have the circle and then the triangle. So it kind of gives you, reminds you of your shapes that you had to learn when you were a little kid. And we do have a pair of acrylic on the turntable, but this is a different uh, color, different style on this one, because this is number 95. And it has some of the earth tone colors to it. So these are really pretty, definitely different. So if you or somebody that likes unique jewelry um, that draws attention, you might want to pick these up because people will ask, what, what are they made of? So see how nice that looks on her ear? So comment soul number 95. So I'm going to show you a nice pair of hoop earrings. So if you're like me, I love big hoop earrings. And these are copper, so they have the copper rhinestones. You see how big those are? This is number 96. So they have a little bling to them. So they're not quite as big as the one that is on the turntable, but if you like copper, kind of like a brownish color look, you might want to pick these up. So, $5. Can you believe that? Only $5. Comment sold number 96. Now I have another pair of gold hoops. This is number 97. And you can see they're a little smaller than the ones that are on the turntable, but they are large hoops. And it looks like they have like a little in, kind of like rhinestones on them also all throughout so they give you that bling look but if you like gold hoop earrings and these are always a classic style hoop earrings they never go out of style common sold number 97 style of hoop. These have pearls on them. This is number 99. So I will call these pearl galore earrings. Look at that. It's in a silver hoop. So they kind of move when you move. So this is number 99. So if you like pearls and you like that hoop style, you can pick these up for just five bucks. Comment sold number 99. Lead and nickel free jewelry right here on Jewelry Box TV.
Okay, now my next pair, they have a little bit of red going through them. And they are silver hoops, and they kind of have that hammered look once again. This is number 100. But they have the red rhinestones going throughout. Nice size hoop earrings, but a different like a circle hoop. So if you like red and silver, you'll love these. Comment sold 100, and they can be yours. Now for the ladies that like a little smaller understated earring, this is number 23. And you have the brown, like a very light brown rhinestone on them. Okay. So it gives you a little bit of bling and they're not really big. And these would make a nice pair for a young lady who doesn't need to be wearing a big hoops yet. You know, she might be a little tween, maybe about 12, 13, 14. This will make a nice pair of earrings for her. And they're only $5. So Comet sold number 23, and they can be yours. Okay, who's number one? These are number one. Look at those purple, pretty earrings. So if you like that light purple, the teardrop shape, and it has a little bit of uh, silver, like filigree cut, that gives them that bling. These are really, really nice. Great for the spring and summer. Comment sold number one, and they can be yours. Okay, now I'm going to show you some of my, I call it fringe or tassel, more like tassel earrings. This is number two, and these are in green and they are post fitting. Okay, so if you like that tassel look, um, that seems to be really, really popular. It's a nice, bright green. And these are very, very long, as you can see, as I'm holding up my little number. So you can see how long these are. So they definitely will probably almost touch your shoulder. So if you like a long dangling earring, pick these up. Number two, five dollars. So here's another pair of tassel earrings. And this is number three. It's like a burgundy and silver. So these are shorter. So as you can see about the size of my number. Okay, so they won't hang as long as the green ones. But if you want a little different color, and they're like a dark purplish burgundy color, you'll like these. So this is number three. Comment sold for a different style of here. Look at these fringe. These are silver. This is number 28. So you have the triangle, a circle, then a triangle, and then the fringe to hang down for love. And so these definitely will move when you move. They're definitely unique look. You're not going to find too many styles like this, not for five dollars. So comment sold number 28. These fun earrings can be yours. And here's the last fringe that I have. It is a burgundy and gold. So you have that gold hammered look, two circles, a small one and a large one. And then you have that fringe, burgundy fringe that hangs down below. This is number four. 
and these are just so fun. So definitely if you like uh, fun earrings, fun jewelry, something unique and different, you'll like these. So common salt number four, and these can be yours. Look how pretty those are. And my last pair of earrings that I'm going to show you today is number five. And these are triangles. And they have like, engravings all throughout. They have a little bit of red and silver through them. And these are very unique earrings. Um, kind of remind me of an upside down Christmas tree almost. So you could wear them the other way if you wanted to and make them holiday Christmas earrings. But um, they have like an ethnic uh, look to them because of the carving or engraving on the earring. So this is number five. And this is a post fitted earring, and they are only five dollars. Comet sold number five. Yep, get that look at that turntable because they're still available if nobody said comet sold. All right, so if you did say comet sold on any of the earrings that you've seen. I do take all forms of payment. I take Visa, MasterCard, American Express, Discover, and I take Cash App. And if you need to pay by cash, um, we can meet up. I can do a drop-off, drive-by, and um, I'm not charging for shipping on this show or delivery. So if you see something that you want, as long as you live in a continental U.S., you can get it, and there's no delivery or shipping fee. Okay, something that you can do is, like I said, you can always shop my online website, 24-7, www.jewelryboxqueen.com, and new releases come out Monday through Friday, so the jewelry is always changing, it's never the same, and when you see something, you got to get it, because it may not ever come back again. And if it does come back, it will be a long time before it comes back. So you can shop my website anytime. I'm also looking for people who are motivated and passionate and fierce and amazing that would love to join my team, the $5 Glam Squad. And if you want to be an independent consultant, I can help you become that consultant like me. Um, it's a fun job. You get 45% on your commission. There's no catalogs to lug around. You work as much as you want to work. You can make it a full-time gig or you can make it a part-time gig like me. A little sad hustle, um, especially during these changing times where we experienced uh, the biggest job loss in history and you're looking for a way to have some money on the side that you're not dependent just on your J-O-B. Why don't you become a consultant? Hit me up. You can email me at jewelryboxqueen at gmail.com or you can inbox me if you're on Facebook, send me a message and we can talk about it and I can get you all set up. It doesn't cost a lot, only $99 to get started for your own business. So something else that I'm doing that I have always done are fundraisers. If you're an organization um, that kind of missed out on your fundraising activities due to the pandemic, um, you can call me, hit me up, and I can do a fundraiser for you. And you can get $2 off for every sale of jewelry or piece of jewelry sold and um, earn some extra money. It's a different way to do it instead of selling candy, popcorn, candles, and stuff like that. So if you're interested in doing that, please hit me up and let me know, and we can get you all set up to do that. Now, something else that I would appreciate and that would help my business is you can share this show, any of my posts from my Jewelry Box Clean business page. Share them on your page. Like it. You know, let people know that, hey, I know somebody has some nice jewelry. And uh, let them decide because you never know. They may want to buy some jewelry. So you can like and share my page and join my VIP group. I also have a YouTube channel, Jewelry Box Queen. You may be watching me right now on YouTube. And if you are, have you subscribed yet? I hope you did. If you didn't, please do. And if you're watching me on Facebook, go to YouTube and my YouTube channel, Jewelry Box Queen, and watch and subscribe there too. Okay? 
So, this is a wrap for my earrings galore show. I think um, we had a nice variety for you. And this party is now closed. And if you see anything, um, you missed it, you can watch it on replay. And if it's still available, you can definitely have it. But I appreciate you um, watching. I appreciate your support. And I will see you next time. I am Karen Craig, the Jewelry Box Queen, Paparazzi Independent Consultant, 232-631. See you next time. Bye. All right, say bye, Miss Sierra. Drama Queen.